the whole equipment management umbrella in terms of looking after the equipment has to be taken back through our partnership with our customers, our dealers and with Caterpillar. And um, this is really taking equipment management or asset management or even just looking after the customer's equipment a step further. This is all about proactively looking after the customer's asset and optimizing that asset. You know, if we're looking, if we're talking about fuel burn, if we're talking about uh, uptime, uptime of the machine, it's really taking that a step forward using technology, but you can't just stop there because you can grab data, you can have a lot of data points. If you don't have an organization to capture that data and optimize that data, then it's not gonna be a lot of good. Taking that, da that customer data be able to manage and crunch that data and then go back to the customer and tell him if his machine is working the way it should be, uh, when he needs to do his scheduled uh, maintenance and repairs, uh, how much fuel burn he's, uh, do, he's uh, taking on the machine, um, whether the operators actually use the machine correctly. It really is a, a full umbrella and it really fits nicely in terms of what Caterpillar is about and what our dealer is about. I enjoy talking about our competitors because our competitors keep us, keep us on our toes and keep us improving and this really is about continuous improvement. I really do think it is the, the foundation of having that three-way partnership between again the, the customer, the dealer and, the, and Caterpillar. This isn't an organization uh, where we walk away when things get difficult. Um, it's, an it's an organization where we will enjoy the good times and we'll stand behind our dealers and our customers in the bad times. And I think that really is the foundation. I really look to see how equipment management and the whole umbrella of uh, uh, condition monitoring, equipment manager, how we can really now, we've taken the machines to a level of technology where you're really coming to the limit. And now if you, if you interject the technology and the data, then we can start really managing that asset proactively and use all of the great things that our dealerships have to offer around the world to ensure that from a customer's perspective, he's optimizing his machine. And again, optimizing it from how much fuel he's using, optimizing it from uh, when he's gonna do a repair. Uh, we all understand the repair before um, a failure mentality. This really takes it to another step and it's very, very exciting. The challenging environment our customers facing today means that um, they're quoting jobs at very minimal margins. Um, it is a very competitive environment. Uh, people are struggling to continue. And if we look at the equipment management or equipment management solutions and how customers can benefit from that, if they're looking at a job and they're trying to cost the job, if they know up front how to optimize their machines, how to minimize the fuel burn through equipment management, where the machines are going to be working, even to the extent of how the operators are using the machines. This is very much a holistic view. In using equipment management, we're taking out some of the guesswork, taking a little bit of the equipment, uh, equipment management solutions and taking all of that data management and being able to use the combined resources of a dealership like CGT backed up with a corporation like Caterpillar, um, it really is a, is a winning combination.